Well, this is an unexpected surprise. Hey guys, hello everyone, I am back. Welcome back to oh, to a brand new video, and uh, we are reviewing something completely different. This isn't import. But since this year is the year of Shadow, aka the GOAT himself, my favorite Sonic, my favorite Sonic character of all time, Shadow the Hedgehog, and uh, well, Sonic 3 is coming out in December, around, well, around the same month as my birthday. <laughs> it's a win for me. And also, I get to play Shadow Generations tomorrow, so yay for that. So, we are here to review the Jazz, not Jazz, sorry. Jack Pacific Sonic uh Sonic 3 movie four pack figures. Now this four pack you can only buy from Target. And well if well if you bought if you bought all if you bought like all four figures separately, then you're good. But uh Yeah, so alright, so let's just talk alright, so how can I do this? Alright. So let's go to least favorite first. And uh, to to start with least favorite, yeah, I'll be honest, Chief. This tail has some good articulation, but at the same time, uh, go ahead and drop my lights. This tail has some great articulation, but at the same time, it's not the best because I know a few cop, I know that a few people can't. Can't help it to know, notice that uh, their copies of Tails doesn't stand well. By the way, I just woke up, so please forgive me if I'm talking if I'm talking like very fast or slow. But yeah, he had good articulation, but at the same time, it's scared because this is so easy to break. Yeah, yeah. This isn't uh, this this isn't bad. This isn't bad or anything, but it's not that good either. Could have been better. I like the articulation, but at the same time, I think Tails is the weakest one here because he doesn't pose that much, and his stubby legs. Yeah. I mainly had to say because I may have to say because uh well both uh, both well his tails obviously got the bigger treatment in this figure right here and uh yeah it's kinda sad though. But he but he's not but he's not all bad but I felt like he could have been better. I don't know. I wish I um all I'm wish all I'm ask, just asking that I wish that uh he had more articulation. But that's just me. His tail had articulation, but uh, his legs and arms are so stubby that he doesn't move a lot. Alright, so let's go on and talk about the man himself. The main antagonist of the second movie. Yes, I love both movies. Nucko himself. It, Mr. Echidna, the man that got hurt. Mr. Echidna, the man that got to protect the Master Emerald. Love this figure. Good articulation, good possibility. My only issue is that uh, he, his head cannot move. Same goes, this also goes with his body as well. See, trying to move the head, the body, trying try to move the head while moving his body, it doesn't cut. The both, the both like, it's attached together and stuck. Not stuck. More like they just don't move separately. Yeah, good articulation. You, you can pose him. You can pose and do whatever like fighting stance you want. I gotta say, these figures feel like the import level, and uh, I was honestly impressed when I first saw the Shadow and Sonic because I couldn't find those two anywhere. But now, out of nowhere, my local Walmart was selling the Sonic. I saw a Robotnik one time. I didn't buy Robotnik because, well, I just don't care for the Robotnik. I just didn't want Robotnik at the time. Maybe one day, I'll, when I go back, pick him up, but yeah. But yeah, oh, look at that. There's like a little smudge there. Huh, <laughs> low, nice. But yeah, this is how, yeah, this is how far, uh, 
you can pose them. Like, boop. Uh, sorry. And, uh, yeah. He doesn't come with a lot. Because about 90 figures don't have accessories. Yeah, that's not a bad thing. We talk about Sonic really doesn't cover any the Sonic characters don't cover any accessories in the movie. Well, Sonic X, but that's but that's a whole different uh Sonic. And I love that show. Alright, so let's go on this let's go on this to Sonic. Now Sonic Shadow are the big are the best figures of this four pack. And uh, if you don't if you don't have the four if you didn't buy the original copy of Sonic and Shadow, then you bought this, then you're good. Because if you press this, this this lights up. But unfortunately, my copy this uh, the tag is stuck inside, and I can't get it. So unfortunately, uh, so unfortunately, I cannot get the. Uh, the blue, the lighting effect on this figure to glow, but uh, that doesn't change. But uh, that doesn't change my opinion because this this guy's really good. Good articulation, good poseability. It's like this is this is like uh, if Jack Pacific did like an import because this figure literally imports level of so good. <laughs> Say they did, they did really good. Cause oh my goodness! And you, and uh, no smudges on here by the way, none of that. Again, my only issue that I can't, I can't show his light, his light effect, and that's it. But besides that, good articulation, good posability, good paint app, so good. This is so accurate to to what he looked like in the movies, and I love it. Now let's go on to the best figure of the four pack. And I beat best figure. <laughs> I really mean best figure of the four pack. And I can only hear a song playing in the background all of me. But I'm not going to play it in the video due to copyright reasons. Due to copyright. And well, I'm not, I'm not trying to get this channel claimed by Crush. The ultimate life for himself. Mr. 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 Every time someone, every time the audience scream, Maria dies. Maria! <laughs> By the way, this is a light effect for Shadow. So cool. So, uh, Shadow the Hedgehog. So, why did I say this is the best Sonic figure of the four pack? This figure basically upgrades everything that was so good about Sonic figure. Oh, this figure basically upgrades everything that was so good about Sonic figure, but this is just 10 times better. Posability, articulation, and I, I, you can do so many with this. By the way, if you have the bike, if you bought the Shadow the Hedgehog bike from Target, you can give it this Shadow because he can, well, he can pose with that bike. I gotta go get that bike. But, uh, this child is so good. You can make it do any pose if you want. Like, like it's a simple pose like this. Make it look like a badass. Like, damn. Then look at Shadow looking at the wind. Think about Maria. <laughs> you can even pose him. Do like any fight stance you want. Because, buddy, this figure. This figure is my favorite out of the four pack. Am I being biased because Shadow... Okay, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm being biased, and I have no, and I have no regret for that. But, uh, this figure overall is so good. <laughs> Look at this boy kick. Look at this. Boom. Maria! <laughs> but no, uh, this figure. Okay, so... I'm sorry for not talking, but... Let me explain to you why I say that this is the best Sonic figure of the four-pack. Now, if you have the original Shadow figure, then that's good. But apparently from what I heard, that figure, oh, that figure is amazing. But at the same time, there's, uh... 
his, uh, his, like, what? I think, like, what? His face is inaccurate. Okay. But, uh, his face look, his face look accurate here. Same for the boots, the gloves, the design, everything. So, why did I say, so why do I say this is the best Sonic figure? Out of the four pack. Unlike Sonic, this guy is 10 times better because articulation feel more smoother. The poseability feel more smoother. And I feel like they give way more, t they give way more time and love to Shadow instead of the other three. And, uh, well, okay, the other two. And, uh, they said, you know what? Sonic was good. But how can you make a figure that's way better than, than Sonic? Let's make Shadow. And uh, they did that so well. They knock it out of the park with this four pack. So if I had to rank them, Shadow, Sonic, Knuckles, Tails. But this guy? Yeah, I know. This, this Shadow figure is top. T it's in my uh, list of favorite figures of this year. Yeah, I know. This guy's crazily good. Imports level is good, and you know how much I love imports. Well, duh, I talk about imports all the time on this channel, but this guy, dude, I don't know what uh, Jazzware did. Not Jazzware. Why am I thinking about Jazzware? Oh, I know why. I'm probably, I'm probably thinking, I'm probably thinking about a, I'm probably thinking about an old toy, an old toy franchise they used to do. My bad. But Jack Pacific. Jax Pacific did so freaking good with this, uh, with this figure, because, oh my god, the Sonic figure, the figure from the original Modern Sonic line were already good, but this knock is out of the park, I swear, 2024 is not only the year of Dragon, aka my year, but it's also the year of Shadow. And now Shadow is my favorite Sonic character of all time, like I said. I grew up with Sonic X. I grew oh, and my laundry's done. <laughs> I grew up with Sonic X and a lot of other pieces of Sonic media from when I was a kid in two thousands. And uh Shadow, well, he pressed the heck out of me as a kid. <laughs> I don't know. I was I'm always a sucker for like the anti hero slash uh Bad boy characters in TV show. Well, yeah. You can say like Vegeta, Piccolo, maybe Sasuke, you don't know what Naruto, Hiei, Kurua, Shadow. You can say Batman, but at the same time, not Batman. Batman's a hero. But there are some times he does act like an anti hero. Mainly in comics when uh, no one agrees with him, but still. Uh. Let's see, Deadpool, you can say. I love Deadpool. <laughs> Venom, hell yeah. And many others, but still. This, but still. Shadow is the MVP of this four pack. If you don't have the original copy, that's fine. If you can't find the original copy of Sonic either, that's fine. Buy the four pack, because Target has this. I pre ordered it from Target. And I had no regrets. So thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Follow all my social media description and uh check out my HL, check out my Hobby Link Japan affiliate link in the description as well if you want to buy like anything cool and awesome like anime and toku toys. And yeah, till next time guys, the next figure we review is the Kamen Rider Valen action figure. And yeah, till next time guys, live and learn. Peace, have a nice day.